Alright, fellow collectors, kids of all ages. Um, today I just received an amazing custom. Uh, my boy, friend, uh, artist, amazing. My boy's name, Chiyang Kinman. I can't get the pronunciation right, so I'm going to have to look and read it. I'm sorry. Chiyang Kinman. Uh, just received this today. Came Friday, the mail was at work. This is my match, this is who I am sometimes on the channel, so just don't be scared, you know, to see me without a mask. Um, before we get into everything, before we get into this, Mike Tyson, the original from Storm Toys, <laughs> Sylvester Stallone, Rocky Balboa, okay? And, and then we have uh, another Tyson, the second edition from Storm Toys. If I tell you that this is the better one, anything with seamless rubberized body from Hot Toys or any other company, it's going to get bad. Uh, paint job by Hot Toys is much better. But anyway, I just want to add a little bit of uh, information out there. Fucking seamless bodies that are rubber are garbage. After a while, they deteriorate. Ooh, as so is this one. So if you're ever going to buy this Hot Toys uh, Rocky figure, um, don't pay it no more than $75. Okay, that's what it cost back then. <laughs> pay original price if they want to get rid of it because it's worth this man. It's, it's yellowish and I keep mine indoors in the dark. Cool temperature, no fucking smoking, nothing. Okay, so just letting you know. Alright, real quick. The Division. I am hooked. This is crack, okay? I can't stop playing. <laughs> can't stop, all right? So you'll never see me for about four months until I get to level 30. I'm right now level nine, close to level 10. I've been on it for almost 24 hours. These are still pictures. There he is, man. That's what's there. Check the back of the box. Right there. And this beautiful still picture, you'll see it hitting the meat. Hitting me, <laughs> it's unbelievable, unbelievable. And this guy is gonna be going in here with the pictures in the back. This is a uh, plexiglass case that I had made. Don't mind the inside. That's supposed. That's gonna go inside. Those pictures are gonna go in here. I'm gonna display this in my office, and uh, it's gonna look unbelievable when I'm done with it. And of course, can't have. You can't rock you, you know what I'm saying? Like that, you can't rock it by himself without Mickey. You gotta have Mickey. So I got this from Marty Quinn, an awesome, awesome collector uh, in one six scale. The guy has everything. So, so I got this from him, I'm gonna have it painted, bring it to life, and uh, get the outfit. And that's gonna look awesome. And in, and in lieu of the new movie coming out, there's Superman choking the shit out of Batman which is supposed to happen in the real world. This is no bullshit, all right? This ain't comic books, man, this is real, real. I'm just, I'm just kidding. All right, yeah, I got the background going, so I hope it's not too loud, but I had to. Okay, so here, basically, let me tell you a little story about this bad boy right here. He made 64 of these beautiful Rocky Balboa figures, 34 of them, if I'm not mistaken, come with Butkus. 30 of them come without Butkus. And um, it is amazing job that he did. Now he collaborated with his father. Um, his father, he loves his dad, I know for sure. And a couple of other people that worked on this project. Clothing, every head sculpt, every hand, every... Uh, piece of meat, every buckets he painted, he had his hands on that all the time. They used painting them up. So of course, there's 64 of them. There's gonna be 64 different variations, slight different variations. I mean, you know, the consistency is gonna be there, but you know, it's painted. It's awesome. So, got this box, got artwork, glued art. It's actually like a, like a sneaker box, okay? And uh, it's pretty cool. Hey, you know what? It is what it is, man. 
It's awesome. Is this a little bit expensive? Uh, yes, it is. Did he put his love into this? Yes, he did. Put a lot of love. Uh, he did this foam inserts, and there are, there are four, I think, three or four layers. I'll show you now. Okay, so that's the booklet he had made. Talon Stallion. Now, these are pictures of some from the movie, a few from the movie, and most of them are, I'm sorry, I'll give you a close up in a second, but most of them are pictures of actual step by step progressions of the art of the work that he did. And he put it into like a little art book. Very, very cool idea. I love it. It's fantastic and it's amazing. I haven't looked at it. I'm looking at him with you for the first time. I want to be at awe, you know, as well. He gave you this little cool card, Certificate of Authenticity, right there. And uh, mine is 17 out of 30. Oh, let me rephrase that. Sorry, correction. 30 with buckets, 34 without buckets. Because I'm 17 out of 30. Should have got one. <laughs> Just kidding. And there's Paulie. Now what's interesting about this is that Paulie may be in a video soon with this figure. That's a surprise. And where I'm gonna actually put my review into this is gonna be at Gleason's Gym in Brooklyn. So I wanna be in the environment, you know, in the boxing ring. I had tears, I was watching a little bit of this. So I wanted to get, I wanted to feel the vibe. I love my favorite part of Rocky. This is like, it's the Rocky 2. Let's get this out. Let's go, let's go by, I, I'm so excited. <laughs> All right, so here, here he is. I'm gonna give you a close up in a second. First tray, you got, I wanna see the back if he did what I wanted, thought what he was going to do. Yes, he did. Italian Stallion, right there. And let me tell you something. He went through a lot of painstaking thinking and he wanted to do the right beanie. So what he did by us, man, he actually, all right, it's glued. He actually, man, it looks nice. Body feels good, joints are good, there's movement. He did the, you know, he did the converse, a little, a little high like the way it was, the way it is, you know, Rocky didn't have a really V, v shape when he wore these sweatpants. He wasn't the most attractive, you know, just threw in his sweatshirt into the sweatpants, made them look all squarish, you know? So there was really, the waist is not really, uh, you know, no tapered. Um, he did the, wow, oh man, he did the gloves, he wrapped up the hands, I mean, the wrapping of the hands. Yeah, it's just fucking awesome. The towel around the neck, the blue light blue towel, the beanie, that's what he, he, he sculpted the beanie. And then what he did was then he said, ah, you know what, I'm gonna have somebody make them. And so he made them, the fabric, I, I believe it's glued on. I'm not gonna start peeling it. And you know what? Fucking eyes, man. He, he, yeah, he did Rocky's thing here with the eyes. Beautiful. Definitely gonna give you guys a close up of this. It's perfect. This and the 19, 78 Superman is my world. Here's some extra hands that came probably with the figure, with the body itself. Um, oh man, I don't even know what this is, but it looks cool. Oh, oh shit, he fucking did it! Eggs, baby, eggs in the morning, the run, four o'clock, look at that, in the glass cup. Oh my God, I'm gonna cry. I used to do that when I was a kid. Oh my God, bloody, bloody wrapped hands, like that. So he's got them, he's got them clean, he's got them bloodied up. Oh my God, it's crazy. And we got, we got here, oh man, I gotta figure what this is. But it's made out of metal, hold on. <laughs> I'm assuming that's the meat hook. That's awesome. <laughs> and then you're hanging it. Oh my God, it's so crazy. I love it. So his father played a little part into this. He actually designed where the meat is gonna hang. And uh, that's pretty cool. 
and he also put the uh, candy there, the Hot Toys candy, into this tray. The next tray is, oh my god, the next tray is a Hot Toys stand. Cool, it's Rocky, and in the Rocky, he has him with his hands up. The victory, love it. Let's use this bad boy for now. I'm super excited, guys. This is awesome. This is bringing me back 1976. You know? This is it. This, this is what I'm talking about. I know this is Rocky 1979. But man, this is awesome. Oh my god, the Converse are crazy. Oh my god. I mean, they had this done. This is sick. It's beautiful. I don't want to drop it. Wow. I love the broad shoulders on here. From the back, it looks awesome. Hold on. Ooh, it elbows a little. Oh, I'm going to find out what kind of body this is. Hold on. <laughs> yeah. What are you looking at? Yo, Adrian. Come here. I want to ask you something. We did it! And then I did it! Sly, baby. This was the movie, man. If you're 49 years old, a little older, a little younger than me, it's just the baddest movie ever. Alright, so, last tray. Buckus is there. Um, Buckus and the meat. <laughs> Wow, wow, side of beef, man. What a freaking paint job. I love the head sculpt, okay, guys? Love it. Beautiful. Okay, so Buckus is, is magnetic. I'll tell you what happened here, no problem. It's wearing a Philadelphia Eagles jersey, which I'm a little bit, because yeah, I'm a Giant fan, New York City. But you know, Philadelphia's Philadelphia. Wow, look at this. Two different variations of the meat hook. We're gonna go high. Made out of super solid metal. We're going to put the chain on there. I'm gonna drop this to the side here. And, <coughs> excuse me. Love this movie. I'm assuming there's a little hole here, and I hope it goes right there. Wow, waited well. Dad did it. Rocky's about to blast this. Wow, this is unbelievable. I'm going to definitely give you guys a close-up to the inside of that slab of ribs there, man. Now, let, you know what, let's move to the side here. Now, Buckus. So he did Buckus like this. He uh, sculpted, he sculpted this bad boy first, I guess, and then he did the body. He could put the jersey on. So he used two magnets, and that's how this guy sticks on. And then there's a seam here, but because, it's no problem. This is no problem. Because the magnet is so powerful, it came off the glue. But I'm going to stick it back. I think I, I can get this going here, there. And of course, oof, I have to re glue it with uh, stronger glue. No problem. This happens. This is no problem. Okay? So don't fucking start saying, look at what I'm on your page, it ain't glue it right. Da, 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 da. I don't want to hear that shit. You can resolve this, it's no problem, guys. If you got yours and if it came off, it's not a big fucking issue, okay? And it's good that I'm letting you know. See, so the magnet is so strong that it, it goes on to the body, comes off the head, and then of course, because the glue is not holding it, 
you're just gonna fall out. But that's no problem. But buckets, I love dogs, it's awesome. So, body is, is sick. He put even like a little felt on the bottom of the feet. The jersey is, is cool. I wish I had an Adrian to go with this. Um, I can only tell you is that this was part of my childhood growing up and uh, this actually means so much to me. I had to, you know, I had to pick one, I had to pick it up when I, uh, when I actually found out about this. I, I PM'd him right away on Facebook and the only way to get this was to reach out to him. This, is, was, this wasn't something that you could just, uh, you know, you're not going to buy this anywhere. There's uh, 64 of us that have this. And uh, some of us, some of us ha have it with this, with Buckus. Now, this played an, an amazing part in my life growing up, so uh, I am super happy. I think it looks fantastic. I'm, I'm so excited about it, you know. And, you know, he puts a lot of love into his work. I, this is my first uh, figure from him. It won't be my last. If you make something that I really love, I will definitely jump on it. Um, he's done some amazing, amazing looking pieces, you know, in the uh, in the past. And uh, he's just gotten better and better with um, with time. And of course, his experience is, is amazing. Um, just to think about that, that he put all this together. You know, it took a long time to do it. And every custom world, uh, you know, artist that's in the custom world, you know, their imagination and, and, and you know, their sense of ability to actually create, the creativity that they possess is just amazing. And it goes with Hot Toys, it goes with Into Bay Storm Toys, it goes with Did, Did is like amazing as well. And, and also statue manufacturers, you know, guys that do statue sculpts. I mean, this is just part of the hobby. I'm loving this little uh, cup with uh, eggs now. Yo, this is awesome, man. And really, it's it's crazy. It's fascinating. <laughs> I mean, that's awesome. I I forgot about that. I don't I don't remember. I think he did. Yeah, I think he he, he did uh, put a picture. He did a progress pictures. You know, on Facebook, you follow him, and uh, you see the uh, the work being created. Um, again, <laughs> I just want to say um, thank you, thank you very much. Uh, you bringing back my uh, childhood. I see this movie. All I keep thinking about is uh, at that time how I felt. My favorite scene in Rocky, Rocky one and two of my favorite movies from the Rockies, from all the Rocky movies. Um, I remember Pauly coming in drunk, you know, and Adrian and Rocky are there sitting down, and uh, you know, uh, Pauly goes through, you know, his thing is he knows he's losing uh, his sister, you know, to someone, and. Uh, and, and you know, he feels threatened, but this is where Adrian becomes, you know, becomes a champion as well as Rocky, you know, this is where she stands up for herself because she has someone there by her side. And that right there uh, made me, when I was young, you know, feel like, you know, I can do something, you know, and, and, and you know, fight against the odds, you know, and, uh, that, that, that was it, man. That's uh, one of the best parts, one of the best scenes for me in Rocky was that. And he got up, what? But what did I do, Paul? You lied, what? And he goes, you're busted! You know, meaning like, at that time, you know, busted means like, you know, they pop, pop the cherry, whatever, and he's trying, he's trying to like, demoralize his sister, you know, and then, you know, Rocky comes in, you know, and he's just like that, and Paul, he's like, yeah, you know, and, uh, and then Adrian goes, and you know, she leaves with Rocky, man. She, that's when, you know, she got fortified by his energy, and, you know, and the Paulie's negativity created Adrian to go with Rocky. And that shit, is, I mean, you gotta look at that movie, you know, and see what Rocky was, Sylvester Stallone was writing, and how he looked at that movie, you know? It was, it's awesome, you know? The whole thing, you know, I did it, and then, then Adrian, we did it. You remember those two? Those two different. I did it. You know, even though they were together and all that's going on, I did it, and he did do it, man. This guy did it, man. He's uh, he's the man. He really did a great job. I'm super stoked about it. It's beautiful. I want to thank you, 
And I want to thank all of you guys watching this. If you guys got it, congratulations. If you didn't, I hope that one day people can move it on. Not to kill you, but to actually help you. You know, those guys are probably going to move on, move this piece on. And I hope they, they sell it to a, to a collector and a person that appreciates the movie. And again, I want to say thank you guys for uh, checking it out. I'll definitely do an in-depth review and a real close-up of everything so you guys can actually see it in detail. And uh, that's going to be at uh, hopefully in a week's time at Gleason's Gym. Definitely going to head out there and uh, maybe also have a little uh, talk with Paulie and let Paulie uh, check him out and, you know, do something from, uh, from the movie, you know? Anyway, boys and girls, you know how I always say, I know you don't like me, but you like my style.